Oh, they're... I see them. They're down here, oh my Dad. lord. What's wrong? What are you doing, Fidel? Taking a walk. Maybe I should come along, too. I'll come, too. Perfect. Then let's be on our way. I just hope their skills weren't switched, please. 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 Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. That's all I ask, for you to not switch my stuff. Don't take off my stuff, okay? Seriously. That's all I wish for you to do. Don't take my stuff off. That's all. I legitly, that's... The only thing that would make me happy if you don't take my shit off. Okay, so we got them. Uh, we're probably gonna go on the bridge. There's no one else over there. And I bet you there's gonna be people on the bridge now. Watch. Watch. Guaranteed, they're gonna be on the bridge. Aha! The problems are just piling up. We can't let this escalate to all-out war. Kranos is sure to make an official demand for her return. You don't think erasing her symbols is viable anymore? Even if it is, it's unlikely to defuse the situation at this point. <sighs> It'd be so much easier if Little Miss Starlight had never been created. <gasps> Captain! <gasps> oh no. Really? Oh no! Oh my What's goodness. Called for? I know. I'm sorry. Wow. I feel sorry for her. That even hit me. Not gonna lie. Um, let's go to private quarters. Maybe she's there. Damn, that even hit me. I'm not gonna lie. I was just like, oh man. that That's not what you wanted to say. That's not. Dang it. Please be here. Doesn't look like it. Nope. Okay, well, that was worth a try. Oh, wait. No, don't tell me. Don't tell me. She ran to the cargo bay and took the ship. Don't. Aurelia! Leave me alone. Everyone would be a lot happier if... If only I weren't around. That's not true at all. You know that. It's okay. I'm tired of this. No. Don't do it. Leave me alone. Fidel! I promised that I'd protect you. If you left me behind, I wouldn't be able to live with myself. If you're going to jump, Relia, then let me jump with you. Never be able to rid yourself of that pain. It might influence how you live until the day you die, but right now, Relia, I want you to live for me. Without you, there's no chance I could ever be happy. Please don't do anything like this ever again, okay? If for some reason you ever stop believing in yourself, Always believe in me instead. <laughs> I thought she was going to take the ship and like leave. I didn't think she was going to try to jump off. If anyone deserves the blame here, it's me. I apologize for my behavior. I never meant that I didn't want you to be created. It was a poor choice of words. We're very sorry that we brought this incident upon you. We won't do that again, right? Well. All right, hard to save the sister, yeah. hopefully. Miki, Fiore, Victor, Relia. You're all needed on the bridge. All right, on to the bridge. The bridge. 
Hopefully we don't have five hour cutscene. That, that one cutscene on the fucking ship took forever. I'm here guys, what's up? Do you happen to recall what that enemy captain said before we fought in front of Relia's holding cell? Something about a shuttle, right? Mm-hmm. He said when you go to the research lab, put that one in the shuttle as well. Mm-hmm. Good memory. From that statement, we can obviously infer that Ferry is inside their research facility. The Kronos research facility, huh? We found two of their symbology labs in the course of our journey, though. Aha, uh -huh, Eureka! One of them got blown to bits and is useless now. So the only one left is Symbological Facility Prime on the banks of the Isoc. Okay, everyone to the transport room. We're coming for you, Faria. All right. Now, the important thing. Please, don't switch my roles. Please. Okay, okay. We're good. Equipment? How about equipment? We good on equipment too? Okay. Alright. Okay, good game. Good job. Good job. Because I was going to be uh, disappointed. Disappointed if uh, I had to put everything back on and shit. So. That would have really sucked. Oh, there's a whistle thing. Okay. We'll meet in front of the turbo lift. All right, well, how many we got two? Okay. The one over here? No. This one's right here. Person, okay. You can't look Anne in the eye, right? Uh, no. That's not true. <laughs> not at all. I know this one. Here, you'd say Anne has you whipped. Whoa, who taught you that? <laughs> it Miki? It was Miki, wasn't it? Emerson, you're scary. <laughs> oh, that was a good conversation, though. I like that one. That one was a good one. Best conversation so far. You're always handling a bunch of different machines, aren't you? It's part of my job. Could I maybe try that one out? Please. Pretty please. I'm sorry. As much as I would like to. The rules... Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay, then. I won't pester you anymore. I'll be as great as you someday, and Just you wait. All right. Well, that seems to be everything. Yeah, I'm glad we got that one cutscene. <laughs> oh, that was good. Very good. Okay, so let's get some items. I'm looking for reviving items, these, such as this uh, fresh sage. Some of this fresh sage, and someone just texted me that, or someone just left a comment on a video, which I'll probably see during one of the cutscenes. If it's a comment, for sure, I'll definitely see it. I might even say it out loud, depending on what it is. If it's an actual question, I can uh, give out, and it's Star Ocean related. If it's channel related, I probably will still say it. That way other people don't uh, ask me later. Or well, at least less people don't ask me later. I would, I would say it's impossible for someone to not ask me again. Oh, let's purchase two of these, actually. Okay. All right. Uh, max HP plus 500. Okay, attack. Yeah, nothing too great. Nothing too great. Okay, so let's save it. Let's save it. Because you never know what could happen. You never know. Where's my phone anyways? Oh, it's way out there. It's way out there, so. All right, where are we going? Oh, I don't I don't know where we're going. Oh shit. Mm. I think there was two of them here, wasn't there? This one blew up. No, 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 I'm... Fuck, where am I going? Hold on. Hold on, is there like... Hold on. Oh, I need captain before entering. Bridge Emerson and Andy Safiria is being held captain and symbology 
Facility Prime. Okay. Symbolic Facility Prime. But where's that at? Um. Let's go here and we'll see. I have to open up like the map. Let me see. No, Slattery. Northern Territory and Eastern, Western. Oh, actually, yeah, that, that was it. All right, that's the one that... Right, this is the correct one. This is the place where we fucking had to protect Anne. Right. And it was fucking a bitch to do. Right, I remember this fucking bullshit place. No wonder it took me a while to fucking remember it. Please don't make me protect her again. Updated their security software. No, this would don't. Be so much easier if they were idiots. Will it take much longer? No, it won't. Because this time we can use our ship's main computer. Don't. Don't. Don't make me protect Anne Protection again. Complete. We can now override the facility's transporter. Wow. Can you send us to the third basement floor? The one with the gigantic terminal? You know it. Three floors down, you say? That shouldn't be a problem. Don't make me protect Anne. Good. 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 I would have been heavily disappointed and angry if I had to protect Anne again. Oh no, there's more robots! This time there's like 50 of them. And you have to kill them all. Alright. If we were here before... Okay, it's just right there, so we could just legitly just... Run across, save it, and then run to the star. Alright. Let's go ahead and save. So we can go ahead and save the other one. Go ahead and save the other one. Okay. Let's go ahead and go up. And I guess we have to go to the computer. Are we gonna have to protect Dan? This one wasn't so bad. I hate so the to protect say this, Dan. But it looks as if this terminal doesn't contain any information on Faria. It makes sense they pull a stunt like this, considering the entrance and security system is reprogrammed as well. Well then, should we try to search for another terminal or something? There are definitely rooms we haven't checked yet, so if we search them all high and low, then what a oh. warm reception. All right. Oh, well, we'll take that. Alright, there's fucking black ones now. I don't remember fighting black ones. Oh, the black ones don't seem to do anything different than the other ones can do. Alright, what is going on out there? What the hell? Okay. Well, a bunch of uh, magic spells were happening. That was easy. Okay, so where are we going? I'm guessing the bottom floor. That's my guess, because honestly, I mean, they came from this way, so... that's That would be my guess. That there would be more down. Okay, uh... Oh, there's a fifth floor. Right, last time we didn't go over here. Right, this we didn't go over here last time. Okay, what's on the fifth floor? Let's see. Okay. I see chests and what is that? Who are you? I'm Rafine, the curator of the biological specimen room here. Please follow me. I'll take you to the girl you seek. Wait, why would someone like you cooperate with us? Because I deemed you formidable. Formidable? Not a single one of the researchers in this division are working here of their own accord, including me. We've had enough. We simply can't involve those two any longer. The issue, however, is that releasing them solves nothing. They will continue to be sought out by one party or another. They must be protected from both Kronos and the Federation. Come this way, please. This could be a trap. Stay vigilant. Yeah. 
Well, I got items right now. Let's learn some skills real quick. She could be telling the truth or she could be bullshitting. Oh, Cyclone Blade and Abyssal Gate. What would Victor get? Diabolic Edge and Bloodstorm Revolution. Let's read them both. Cyclone Blade, swing into the air while spitting to cut down surrounding enemies. Those caught in the attack will be launched helplessly into the air. Okay, 340% power. Gather energy, then charge toward an enemy and deliver a merciless blow. The aura and delve your body may damage the enemy as well. Okay, 250%. Max hits is 6. Max hits on the other one is 5. Now let's read Victor's. Swing your weapon around to generate a whirlwind that draws foes towards it. And then let's... Let, let's I don't even know what that word says. Something them. It's... Wow, it's 10 hits and 340% power. That's not bad. Diabolic Edge. Attack in rapid succession with, while charging forward. You will send enemies flying as they continue their charge. Okay. What is 7 on, on Fidel? 7 is Cyclone Blade. Okay, I'm going to have Abyssal Gate. And then I'm going to give Victor Bloodstorm Revolution. To be 100% fair. Uh, is there anything else? What about you? You got to learn anything? No? Okay. Okay, so... We have Gravity Bullet and we have Triple Kit. Both of them are Delta? Yeah. Alright, Gravity Bullet. Fires an extremely dense, slowly moving projectile that draws near enemies towards it as it plods forward. Okay, max 7 hits. Triple Kick. Bombard an enemy with, with the series of 3 del deliberating kicks that temporarily lowers his attacks and leave him crying for his mother wow just because it's gonna leave him crying for his mother we gotta quit triple kick so triple kick it is all right These what are we looking are at all corrupted so you are the ones who did this yes that is one aspect of our research uh oh why Was it a trap? Drones here? They aren't authorized to patrol this section. It's time to fight fire with fire. Attack! Oh wow, why was he looking that way? No time to Ow. Oh, she's actually fighting with us. And she's actually fighting with us. I mean, she's probably not doing much though. All right, where are we going? Now keep leading the way. I mean, you're. It feels like I'm leading the way now. Okay, now she is. All right, who's? Holy shit! Well then, okay. Well then, let's kill these plants. Oh, these plants are easy. Yeah, we're we're so over leveled for this. I must use this gift to protect others. All right, let's see. Okay, we're almost done with this area. So let's go. Where is she? Our destination's beyond the store. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, what is that? Boss battle. Oh shit! I dodged it. The mana core. Ow! Ow! Calm down! Calm down! Calm down! Wow, something did seventeen thousand to it. Oh my goodness! What is doing twenty-one thousand to it? Who is doing that damage? Who is that? Yeah, something is doing a shit ton of damage to it. Oh wait, I think he's healing. I think he's healing. Oh fuck. How do I do that? How do I neutralize his healing powers? How do I neutralize its healing powers? I'm getting wrecked. Oh. 
What is she gonna do? Stop his healing powers? That would be great. Oh, he slowed him down. Ow. I still got hit by it. <laughs> oh, we actually could kill it. Nice. That slow is actually gonna be able to be enough, I think, to kill it. Because even if it heals, we're doing more damage than it could heal. Oh, screw you. Screw you, buddy. Oh, fuck. Okay. That I didn't know. That I didn't know about. Oh, is he dizzy? It looks like you got dizzy. Oh, he's so dead. You're boned, buddy. You're boned. Oh, fuck. No! Okay, let's just kill him before he comes up. Nice. Nice, man. She made that so much easier. Oh, is she okay? Come on, let's keep going. Don't fall on me. Are you alright? Don't push yourself. I'm okay. We're safe. And it's all thanks to you, Lilia. <laughs> Look! I heard something. Yeah, who is that? Oh, I think I know who that is. It's that guy. General Alma. It's Faria. It's Faria. General Alma, Director. Is it safe to assume this is all going according to plan for you? <laughs> I must say, I did not expect you to turn traitor on us with me. How unfortunate. Get I guess there. she was telling Your the truth. I see you took Relia from us, as I knew you would. Otherwise, you'd hardly be worthy of the Kenny name. Why don't I take Faria as well? Such a loud bark for a small run. I am Thoris, the one and only director of this fine laboratory. Thanks to your tireless efforts, I have collected some truly superlative data. It somehow escaped me that activating space-time symbology catalyzes the release of certain hormones, but you, Fidel, was it? Kindly brought it to my attention. All this was for space-time symbology? I brought it to your attention? What's that mean? In other words, they knew full well that we'd save Relia from that Kronos battleship. Not only that, they wanted us to do it. Then, during that last fight, they monitored Relia's biological responses closely. Thus, they effectively measured certain changes that occur when she employs symbology. Very keen of you to grasp the situation. You're saying you used a whole ship's crew as bait for us? Yeah, this all worked out as I planned. Wow. We only possess two units at the moment, but once we are able to mass produce them, the information we collected from your endeavors with her will certainly be useful to our cause. Mass produce? You use this place to craft endless numbers of people? Do you even understand what life is? <laughs> of all the ludicrous. <laughs> wow, there are dolls in the background Maybe already. Again in the near future. Hand over Faria. Wow. Well, that's gonna suck. If we're gonna go after General Alma, we'll need our ship. Let's hurry. What was that? Really? What? Thank heavens you're alive and well. It's a pleasure Hope this to meet is in you. a trap. I'm Kristoff, one of the researchers here. Are you really his dad? Well, her father figure. Now that you've shown yourself, I take it we can expect some answers vis-a-vis -vis this place? Our symbometric technology far eclipses that of the Federations. As part of that, the research we conducted here was on the ultimate script. Symbols that can physically manipulate the fabric of space and time. Space-time symbols. As I'm sure you are well aware, the Pan-Galactic Federation appeared before Kronos 16 years ago by the Space Gate calendar. In order to combat their overwhelming military might, we embarked upon large-scale research to test the feasibility of using space-time symbols to turn life forms into weapons. 
Then, in Space State 526... That sounds terrible. ...we were coerced by the Federation into approving the CFNZ. Coerced? I don't think so. In order to preserve the peace between our organizations, we had to establish mutually agreed upon terms before approving it. As a universal power, you can rationalize it that way. As the weaker party, though, we had no choice but to submit to those terms. We manufactured countless test subjects, but only succeeded at applying symbols to two of them, Relia and Theria. Those poor things. The military hawks Sounds quickly terrible. waxed their talons onto exploiting these space-time symboforms. They set up facilities here on Fakery and forced us to modify the local fauna. The next step was to release those symboforms into the wild. Up until that point, we had conducted our research clandestinely. Then we received an order from them to pit our subjects against the natives for the sake of gathering data. They told us all this was imperative in order to defend ourselves against the Federation. So, in other words, you're saying everything that transpired here is the Federation's fault? Only that it was the impetus. We simply wanted to conduct our research in peace. Don't make me laugh. Treating a planet's population like lab rats is hardly peaceful. Right. I agree. I know. It was difficult for us, too. We couldn't expose Relia to this travesty any longer, so we helped her escape aboard a shuttle. So, the metal thing that fell in the Dakar footpath was your shuttle? It was, indeed. Sadly, Thoris was apprised of our plan and had the thing shot down once it launched. Now, in order to unleash Feria's full potential, they plan on using the data they collected from the trials you've overcome with Relia. It seems that the Federation's appearance here has put General Alma on edge. I apologize for the impertinence of this request, but please, free Relia and Feria from their fate as instruments of war. With this card, you should be able to enter an edifice known on this planet as the Cygna Silica. Cygna Silica? Once you trek its hallowed halls and reach the shrine within its deepest recesses, you will understand why we chose this planet as our laboratory. Do you have any idea where General Alma might have gone? I see. Well, I appreciate the other info. Let's move out. Really? It's time to say goodbye, Relia. Huh? I'm afraid we can't go with you, honey. Why not? I get it. Now that the Federation knows of this facility, it won't be long before it's destroyed. There is nothing more we can do on our end. Take good care of Relia and Feria for us. Mom. Farewell, my dear Relia. Relia! M, prepare us for transport. Aye, aye, Captain. <sighs> well, I liked having that healer around. <laughs> I don't really care about the uh, parents, not too much. Right, let's go. All right, so where are we going? I actually don't know. Bridge? We're gonna assess our next move? That's all I could think of. Like, we'll go to the bridge and assess our next move. That or, uh, I'm supposed to go somewhere else. Excuse me, I was barely eight. All right, uh. Let's go to the bridge. That's the only thing I can think of. Yeah, I knew it. Okay, good. And the general's whereabouts? We've maximized our ultra long range sensors output in search of it. In search of, huh? So you still haven't managed to find it? I'm afraid not, sir. Huh. 
That doesn't bode well. I'd say the planetoid where we fought that other ship would be a good start. But their territory is so incredibly vast. Hopefully we can find at least some sort of clue as to their whereabouts. Don't give up just yet. We won't. I was, I'm like, are we doing anything? I'm just like, uh, they're doing a bunch of stuff, but I'm still walking really slow. Am I supposed to talk? Should I talk to Victor? No. What am I supposed to do? Hi. Oh my. Why just this spot? Do you know why there's no data for this one area? No readings? How? Uh oh. Captain. Could you please come take a look at this? Did you find anything? I tried scanning the Cygnus Silica, but see for yourself. What the? That's definitely odd. Could it be another Kronos facility? The only explanation is that it blocks every single type and frequency of wave with which we could scan it. Such technology shouldn't even exist on this planet. Shields with this much range shouldn't exist anywhere in the Federation, let alone this planet. Well, not like running our mouths more will solve anything. Let's check it out. I agree. Besides, it's going to take some time to find General Alma in that celestial haystack. As long as this shield is in operation, there's no hope of us transporting directly to its location. Although, even if we could, the structure itself also appears to hinder transport. Can buildings even do stuff like that? I guess that's life's way of telling me I need more exercise. Hey. Huh. Let's just beam down somewhere nearby. We can search on foot from there. Yes, sir. Get ready, ladies and gents. Next stop, the Cygnus Silica. All right, Cygnus Silica. Sure. I got that part. <laughs> 